I don't know who I am, but I know what keeps me alive, keeps me out of jail, keeps me from hurting people. I do as I'm told. What's the point in any of it? It's all just gonna boil up and wash us away. We've come out a few times now acted, acted as a drug. Is that something? Uh, twice, I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it something that comes, it comes easy now? Do you, know, do you know how to get into that kind of mode? Um, well, first of all, I don't drink when I'm working. Um, Unless I have like a 48 hour weekend, then I might have a, some wine on Friday night. But I find that now for me to really be focused, I, I can't uh, drink. So, so what I'll do sometimes is I'll, if there's a, a scene where I'm very drunk, I might spin around in circles to make myself dizzy so I don't have to act and be a little bit out of control of my, my you know, body, body movements. <laughs> Just coordinate it. What He's all beat up. I can't get my hands dirty in every little thing. You know how I get. Why you want to go back to the damn penitentiary, man? Freeze, Joe! How many scenes would you say, like in a movie, do you actually probably lose yourself, with, completely lose yourself within? Is there scenes where you do it and you, you, you've lost yourself in that role? Well, you're always very conscious of... There have been moments like that in my past. There was a movie I made called Face Off where if you look carefully at it in the prison scene where I'm going, oh, I'm Caster Troy, I think there was a moment where I kind of left the building. <laughs> it's pretty scary when that happens, but also exciting because it's so, you know, real. But with Joe, I, I, I didn't really see myself as losing myself, as more like being myself. Well, I'm a working dog. I mean, I love to work. There's no secret to that. I mean, but the irony is that the film industry is one of the only industries where you get criticized for working a lot, but that's okay. The, the, the thing is, uh, I'm going to keep working, and uh, I'm going to keep trying to take chances and, and keep trying to go outside of my own comfort zone, which means if I want to make a horror movie, whether people get it or not, I'm going to make it and uh, see what I can do with that, or if I want to make a a comedy, family comedy about a sorcerer, I'll do that, or a big animated family movie, or, I mean, it's not always understood, my choices, and that's okay, but I, I think if you look carefully at my filmography, there's always going to be some return to my independently spirited dramatic roots, like a bad lieutenant, or a lord of war, or a world trade center, or a weatherman, but, um, but I'm also going to try and keep going with adventure and horror, and I like being eclectic. I, I, li I want to do it all.